and I was in the house alone. And the water came up through the floors. I'm a disabled vet. Uh, I got coronary artery disease. So I, I, my heart started hurting. But then I knew I couldn't have a heart attack because I looked out the window and I, I on the freeway 59 there, Collinsworth. It was like a river. If, if I did have a heart attack, nobody could get to me. I had just moved in in April. So the majority of the things that I had, I lost. The mission of the Harvey Memories Project is to collect and share and most importantly to preserve people's memories of their experience during Hurricane Harvey. So we have a website where community members can upload images, audiovisual recordings, and also stories uh, of what they went through. And what we want to do is make sure that all the perspectives on this storm are heard so that future generations, when they look back on this event, will have a better understanding of what our community went through. In the humanities, you know, we're fundamentally concerned with story uh, and understanding people's experiences as expressed through different media so that scholars can, can come in and study these stories and understand the breadth of experience uh, of Hurricane Harvey. Why is it that I'm not getting any help? Why is it no one coming to my home? We hope that uh, through telling their stories, members of the community can participate in a healing process and feel like their voices are, are being heard. And I think these are all kind of fundamental concepts in the humanities. We need to document those that were affected by the storm. We need to hear those stories. We need to see those photos. We need to hear that audio for generations to come that our grandkids, as well as our great grandkids, will know what has been going on during Harvey. How were my relatives affected? How were my neighbors affected? What happened on this street? What happened in the community? And it's very important that we take the time to archive our stories. We see stories from other communities. Well, what about us?